What's this? More books? Hold on. Here we go. That's like butter. Well, howdy friends, Brian Fleshing of Mad River Outfitters in the Midwest Fly Fishing Schools, and welcome back to another one of our book reviews. And uh, today, uh, I got some really, really exciting news. Um, both of these books are books that I have been selling for years and years and years, many, many years. For a while, they were both out of print, uh, which was, uh, quite frankly, a tragedy in our industry and here at Matter River Outfitters, but they're back and they're back with a vengeance. And first of all, um, uh, fly tying related. So if you're not a fly tier, you might not be interested. Thanks for watching. Uh, please watch the next episodes. But if you're into fly tying, uh, first and foremost, if you're looking to get into fly tying, uh, fly tying made clear and simple is now back in print by our good friend, everybody's good friend, Skip Morris. And it is the original classic, excuse me. The original classic with over 150,000 copies sold. Um, you could be 15001. Anyhow, uh, Skip Morris's book, Fly Tight Means Clear and Simple, has been the benchmark. It's been the go-to book when people are interested in getting started in fly tying. This is the book that we grab and uh, uh, send them out the door, uh, of course, with any uh, tools and materials that they need to get going. Uh, but it is, uh, it is the book on getting started. And he, he runs you through um, basically the fly tying essentials, the tools. He breaks it down into the essential tools that you need and then optional tools, which is nice because in, in my estimation, most fly tying tools are optional. Then he runs you through the basics of materials, and, and then you get into hooks, and then he jumps right into tying. And he runs you through some really simple patterns, but he kind of covers the gamut. He goes through some nymphs, he goes through some streamers, of course a woolly bugger is here, and along the way he shows you techniques uh, as you're learning to tie that fly. Uh, I think I said the woolly bugger, gold rib hare's ear, a stone fly nymph, pheasant tail nymph, and then he jumps into some streamers, and then he finishes up the book with some uh, dry flies. He's even got a soft hackle in here, which, as you all know, I am a soft hackle guy. Um, it's kind of my thing. Uh, but, uh, and then at the end of the book, he runs you through um, some variations on some of those. He talks a little bit about fishing in here, which is cool. Elk hair caddis. Uh, there's a light Cahill parachute style fly. So pretty much covers all the bases. And then he runs you through some kind of addendum of some different fly patterns and recipes. And then some basic principles of fly tang at the end, which are, by the way, spot on. And even an essential etymology right there at, at the end of the book. So uh, they just don't make them better for someone that's looking to get started in fly tying. Um, fly tying made clear and simple by Skip Morse. Of course, you can find it at madriveroutfitters.com and there is a link right down below me. And next, and certainly not least, for beginners, intermediate, and advanced tires, uh, I'm telling you, this is the Bible, the Fly Tires Bench Side Reference. And I'm telling you, this is the encyclopedia of techniques. Now, it's not a pattern book per se, but it covers absolutely every technique you could possibly imagine uh, for tying basic trout flies, although there's some, some different stuff in here, but it is... Like I said, I can't say it enough. It's an encyclopedia. Um, there's, there's everything. Everything you could possibly imagine that you could do with a vise, hook, thread, and basic materials, you can find how to do it in this book. It is just amazing. It is um, 444 pages. And um, just a reference book that you're going to keep at your tying bench that you're gonna browse through and, and learn new techniques that you might wanna try. Or if you come across a pattern, a pattern book, and it says to do this technique, you can always look it up 
on here. It's very well, um, very well laid out. Amazing color photographs. I mean, there's, I don't know how many color photographs and I'm certainly not gonna count them, but there is a lot of color photographs in here. And uh, yeah, we'll just pause right there. And let things clear out. Uh, anyhow, 444 pages. This is not a cheap book. Um, I think when it came out, it was around a hundred bucks and these days it is a hundred dollars, but it's, it's well worth it. If you're a serious, serious fly tire, um, this is, in fact, let's read some experts praise for the fly tires bent side reference, uh, which by the way, it's by Ted Leeson and Jim Schulmeyer, uh, two very well-known, um, fly tires and authors. Uh, but Al Cucci, Al Cucci's a, a, also a well-known author and a good friend of ours. I hung out with Al quite a bit down in the Bahamas bone fishing. But uh, every decade or so, a special book comes along that has such a profound effect on fly tires and fly fishers that it moves the game to another level. The Fly Tires Benchside Reference to Techniques and Dressing Styles is such a book. Gary LaFontaine, God rest his soul, uh, uh, spent an evening uh, in the Montgomery, Ohio police station with Gary, but that's another video, another story. Um, there's one absolutely best way to do a fly tying book. Describe the individual methods for applying different materials. No book has ever done this in pictures and words better than the fly tires benchside reference. This massive, beautiful work is a classic that will be the standard for this foreseeable future. And I could go on. Dave Whitlock, Skip Morris, Gary Borger, A.K. Best, Dave Hughes, Art Sheck, Daryl Martin, they all, John Betts, they all absolutely rave about this book, as am I. Uh, so if you're interested in becoming a better tire, you're interested in having the encyclopedia of fly tying techniques, it's back and it's available at matteroveroutfitters.com. Of course, there's a link right down below me. So fly tires rejoice. Fly tying made clear and simple and fly tires bench side reference to techniques and dressing styles. Available right there and just in time for fly tying season 2022 into 2023, although around here it's always fly tying season. So as always friends, thanks for watching. We appreciate you being here. Be sure to subscribe to our channel. That helps us out. Hit the like button. That just makes us feel good. And be sure to stay tuned because we've got a lot coming your way. And if you're interested in these or any of the books that we talk about, go to matteroveroutfitters.com, browse through our book selection. Uh, we appreciate your support. That's what allows us to continue making these videos. And in the meantime, watch this video. It's pretty good. And this one is excellent. It's probably one of the best we've ever done. So it's a banger. Yeah.